it's me and I'm making yet another video um, what I actually want to talk about is uh, I want to tell you guys how I'm eating now because I've been getting a lot of questions of like oh what are you doing what are you eating now and how are you training and training is a whole freaking different thing like I can make a movie on that so I'll say that for another day but um, as for eating um, this is what I want to show you it's actually it's a book uh, it's called The Eat Clean Diet, and it's written by Tosca Reno. Look how fabulous she looks. You guys gotta see this. Look at her. She's, she's like, she's almost 50, guys. That's insane. Look at that. Freaking woman's got abs like mm. Anyway, basically, um, I bought this book, um, because, um, I bought this book because this is exactly how I eat. So if you guys want to see like exactly how I eat and what I eat and whatnot, this is it. Um, it's I would so take this part out, the diet, and just call it eating clean. And a lot of people call that if you pick up any kind of like kind of fitness and whatever nutrition magazines, it's that term comes up a lot. Bodybuilding comes up a lot. <laughs> Eating clean basically means that you don't eat shit, you don't eat junk, you keep your food really clean, and by that meaning, you know, you have your lean proteins, you have your complex carbs, and you have your healthy fats, and you eat like that, and you live by that, and that's exactly what I do. Um, I, the, the whole, the principles of clean, eating clean are fairly simple, you eat every three hours or so to keep your metabolism going, um, and that's that's basically how I eat five to six meals a day um, what you want to do is you want to have complex carbs at every meal complex carbs th are things like unprocessed you know bread so whole grain whole wheat you know multi-grain whatever uh, pastas as well yeah bread um, um, like brown rice wild rice stay away from the white stuff um, vegetables, all sorts of vegetables, green vegetables are fantastic because they're, uh, they're, fair, they're really low in calories, so you can kind of, you can have a feast off of vegetables, um, they're high in all sorts of vitamins and minerals and nutrients and whatnot, and they're usually high in fiber, which is also something that you want, because what happens with fiber is fiber actually helps you feel fuller, longer, um, because fiber is not really digested by your body. There's like different types of fibers and I'm not really going to go into it, so. But yes, fiber keeps you fuller longer and guess what fiber does? It helps you poop. Yes, it does. Um, it helps every kind of everything moving along. Uh, they recommend, I think, the recommended daily um, fiber is something between 25 to, I think, 30 grams. Most people don't even get a quarter of that. Um, because you got, most people eat the, the processed shit like white bread and white pasta which has zero grams of fiber and the whole wheat stuff actually has, you know, four to five grams per serving which is, you know, it adds up. For instance, I pretty much make sure that I eat at least 25 grams of uh, fiber and all my fiber comes from my food, it does not come from a supplement. Although you could supplement if you want. There are supplements out there. You just want to make sure that they're low-carb supplements, that they're not, like, loaded with sugar or any of that. But, I mean, you know. So, anyway, so that's your complex carbs. You want to eat lean protein at every meal. Uh, mostly lean, you know. You can have, you can treat yourself from time to time to other proteins, such as pork. But you want to kind of minimize that. Like, personally, I don't really eat things that are high in saturated fat. And that's like pork is high in saturated fat or like chicken wings and stuff. I mean, yeah, I'll have the occasional treat, you know. You live, you you know, you have this or that. But I mean, 90% of the time, my diet is really, really clean. Um, so lean pro uh, protein sources are things like chicken breast, chicken thighs, turkey breast, um, you know, egg whites, cottage cheese, uh, tofu, um, you know, on fish, all sorts of fish. Um... The white fish is really low in fat, like any kind of low, uh, white fish is actually low in fat, salmon is high in fat, higher in fat, I wouldn't say high, but the the, f um, the fat that's in salmon is really, really good for you, so do not be scared of, that's another thing you guys have to uh, kind of watch out for fat, which you kind of have to distinguish which fat is good fat and which fat is bad fat, 
because there is such a thing and um, the bad fat is the saturated fat or the trans fats it's like the you know the oil drenched chips aren't exactly the best fat um, but things like yes salmon nuts are fantastic I have nuts every single day all sorts of nuts uh, I throw in uh, almonds in my oatmeal in the morning then I, I have peanut butter during the day I have all sorts of different nuts like sunflower seeds uh, pumpkin seeds are really actually good they're also high in protein um, you'd be surprised like nuts go go well I wouldn't say go nuts with nuts because you really want to watch your portion sizes just because they are high in fat you know, all, you know, as with anything, too much of a good thing is not good for you. So you want to watch your portion sizes there. But eat nuts, guys. Eat nuts. Nuts are good for you. Nuts, nuts, nuts. I love nuts. But uh, yes, so you want to eat that. Um, yes, keep uh protein at every meal. So you like again, like I said, eat every three hours or so. Keep your portion un under, you know, keep your portion sizes in check. Uh, have lean protein and carbs at every meal. I am telling you guys now that I do not sit down to a single meal that has no protein in it. I eat protein every three hours. I think that they, I don't know the daily recommended, you know, protein, whatever for people. I think it's something around like 60 grams for like a, you know, on a 2000 calorie diet or whatever. Do you guys want to know how much I eat? I eat a, between 150 to 200 grams of protein every single day. Every single meal that I sit down to eat has about 30 grams of protein, if not more. Um, you don't want to go too, too high because your body can only absorb so much protein at one time. So you don't want to sit down and eat like 100 grams of protein in one sitting because really, that's kind of like, half of that is kind of going to go spill over and not really <laughs> digest, like it's not going to be used to its full potential. So you want to spread your protein out. But that's how I eat. And this is, you know, if you guys want to pick this up, it's, it's, it's for, it, it is for beginners. So if you're kind of familiar with what I'm saying here, then you probably don't need to read this. But, um, but I mean, like, if you, if this, if what I'm saying now is new to you, the whole, you know, eating three times, every three hours, five to six smaller meals a day with, you know, with, uh, you know, with complex carbs, protein, and fat at every meal. If that's something new to you, then pick this book up because this is literally how I eat. If you read this book, this is how I eat every single day to maintain. And I actually ended up getting the, um, <laughs> look, I got a cookbook, the, the Eat Clean Diet Cookbook. And it's, of course, written by Tosca Reno again. And she's looking phenomenal on the cover, yet again. Um, and guys, this is, this is, this is, honestly, this is the only cookbook that I've ever bought. And I've used it, and the recipes in here are really freaking easy and fun and really tasty. And yeah, there's like stuff, you know, I picked up stuff from here, and it tells you how to make, you know, different breakfasts and soups. And again, it stresses the whole thing of, you know, having protein at every meal. So it kind of, it kind of gives you ideas of how to like, you know, put protein in this, like look at that, power oatmeal pancakes. I actually made these, and they were fantastic, look at that. Doesn't that look good? Like... You guys are telling you, you're, you're in a diet, you don't eat fun stuff. Are you kidding me? I love these pancakes. They're fantastic. They're like, they have like cinnamon in them. They're, they're oatmeal based, obviously. Um, flax seeds and stuff like that. Um, I actually even put, uh, I usually slice up some apples and throw in there as well. And, but it's like, honestly guys, it's, it's not, you guys should, this is, okay, well, whatever. If you guys want to know how I eat, pick this up or read up on eat. Uh, la, la, la. Eat up on clean eating and you will know exactly what I'm doing because this is how I eat every single day for the past two years or so and I love it and this is what keeps me looking this way. Um, there's another video I'm going to make in a second but this is it for now. This is how I eat and yes. <laughs>